Lincoln shuts out the Dockhounds. Chicago evens the set in Milwaukee. And a wild game in Kane County ends in another walk-off. Welcome to the American Association Whip Around on this Sunday. Unfortunately, a couple of rainouts yesterday, but the four games that did go on gave us plenty to talk about today. Let's start things off in Lake Country. Game two between the Salt Dogs and Dockhounds. And how about Tanner Brown, the lefty with six shutout innings, allowed just two hits on the night, six strikeouts as well. And top of the fifth, no score. Drew Devine changes that. His seventh home run of the season, a two-run shot. The All-Star drove in all three runs for Lincoln as they take it three to nothing. To Milwaukee, game two between the Dogs and Milkman. Again, a big set in the East Division. And Kyle Mora was outstanding for the Milkman. Seven shutout innings of his own, five hits, seven strikeouts for the right-hander. This was a low-scoring affair until the late innings. one nothing Milwaukee in the eighth. Josh Altman finally puts Chicago on the board with this RBI double. And plenty more action to come in the ninth as Peyton Eels blasts his first career professional home run to put Chicago up 5-1. to one. A four-run ninth inning gives the Dogs the lead they need as they take Game 2 of the series 5-1 to one and even the set. To Kansas City, Game 5 of 6 between Winnipeg and Kansas City. Top of the first, Max Murphy. Another one, a solo shot way out there to center field. His league leading 21st of the season. Go to the third, goal lies up 4-1 to one when Chris Burgess hits a two-run shot out past the home run patio. Winnipeg hangs on, takes their first game of the series by a 7-5 final. Finally, to Kane County, game of the night, one of the best games of the year. C.J. Eldred had something special going. Gets Hill Alexander here in the fifth. Later on, Jose Sermo in the seventh. Eldred had a no-hitter going until the ninth when Elmer Reyes breaks it up, the first batter of the ninth inning. But what an incredible start. Later on in the ninth, though, down to their final strike, Brett Boswell rips an RBI double to put Cleburne on the board, robbing Eldred of his complete game shutout. We go to extra innings when check this play out from John Cristino behind the backstop. What a diving grab. And it allows this to happen. Tied at one in the bottom of the 11th. A walk-off three-run home run from Galley Cribs Jr. What a game and what a series this has been. Kane County wins it by a 4-1 to final. Here's your final scores from Saturday night. Again, the games in Gary and Fargo-Moorhead, both affected by rain, setting out some double headers today. The six game sets in Kane County and Kansas City are both at four games to one in favor of Kane County and Kansas City. The sets in Milwaukee and Lake Country both tied up at a game apiece. And here's your schedule for today. We've got plenty of games with two double headers starting at 1 p.m. Most of the rest of the games also start at 1 p.m. with the final first pitch at 135 in Lake Country. You can catch all the games this afternoon at aabaseball.tv or get your last-minute tickets through the AA Baseball app. I'm Matt Yazo for the American Association, where we play to win.